All right, Chris. I mean, I know everybody's anxious to get this season started, but it's got to be particularly uh, exciting for you, you know, to, to make the transition from football, come to Alabama, have to sit out. Just, just how ready are you to go? Oh, absolutely. You know, um, it's been a while for me to play uh, on a high level like this, so I'm ready to go. I put in a lot of work in the off season and trying to prepare myself for uh, for Saturday, and uh, hopefully it'll all come together. Even though. You haven't played baseball competitively in a while at this level. Uh, to play SEC football, to be under the gun at quarterback, is there anything that uh, that, that experience can help you with as, as a baseball player in the SEC? I definitely think so. You know, when the lights come on, that's kind of when a, a real competitor shows his color. So, um, and I think, uh, I don't think the pressure will get to me at all. Just be come out and ready to play. And, um, you know, it's been a long time coming, so just ready to get the season started. Having your brother here as a football player, being back home, your parents don't have to travel eight hours anymore to see it. You know, how special is that? Oh, it's good. You know, I've grown up in Tuscaloosa. I've got a lot of friends and family in the area, so I'm sure a lot of them will be coming out here on Saturday. And, um, you know, I've had a lot of support through them and just feel ready to go. South is, is such a good club to have to open the season against. You know, a lot of teams would like to play a, a team that they felt like they pretty much could handle, but uh, this is a big time club to, to be opening up with a pair of games against. Talk about that. Oh, definitely. Uh, South Alabama always fields a real good team, and so we know we're going to have our work cut out for us. We're going to have to come out here and, and play hard and uh, play with a lot of energy, which is what we've been doing throughout these uh, scrimmages the last few weeks. And I think we've prepared ourselves as a team to, to be ready to go into the season. Handling this pitching staff in practice and inter squad games and in the fall, uh, your impressions of them? You know, what what what's their level at, and, and can this be a good starting rotation in the SEC? Oh, absolutely. Um, you know, this pitching staff's put in more work this year than, than I think they have in any years past, and uh, Coach Bunn has really been coaching these guys up, and they're going to be ready to go. Um, they, I've seen a lot of improvement, and a lot more focused group out there, and so I, I think they're ready to come out and prove themselves, prove to these fans, and prove to college baseball that they're uh, they're legit. Finally, uh, talking about transitions from, you know, coming back to Alabama from football to baseball and and now uh, your your single days are numbered from what I understand. <laughs> Talk about uh, the the decision to pop the question. Yeah, I got got engaged over Christmas break and uh, you know, pretty excited about it. So, going to have the, the wedding coming up this summer after baseball season's over. So, uh, just pretty excited about that as well. Well, you know what that means. That means you're stuck with Boney Barino for a, for, a, for a long time. Can you handle that? <laughs> yeah, I guess I'm one of the few people that can put up with him. But, uh, no, nah, he's a good guy and uh, really excited about it.